Joining us this morning is senior runner Clay Watson of Cedarville University, the most recent Yellow Jacket to earn GMAC Men's Cross Country Athlete of the Week status. Congratulations on your first career win at the Carnegie Mellon Invitational with over 170 runners competing. Did you feel like your performance from the All-Ohio Championships where you finished 12th was leading up to this? Yeah, it, uh, All-Ohio was a great um, preparation for this meet. I knew it was a meet that I had the potential uh, to win based on uh, the research coach had done with the different teams. So it was a blessing to be able to to be at the front of the pack and, and to um, that God would bless me with the win. So it was, a, it was an awesome experience. In terms of stability with a consistent lineup, has it been challenging for you guys to figure out how good this team really can be? Uh, I believe you missed one event and Benjamin Tuttle, one of your seniors, also was absent with an injury. Yeah, definitely the loss of our top guy, Ben, has been a huge uh, loss for us and we're hoping to get him back as soon as we can. Uh, it can be, depending on the size of the meet, it could be a 50 point loss or 100 or 150. You know, it just it can be a huge loss for us not to have Ben in the lineup. Um, and also, we've been having some really great PRs from our three to five spot guys, and, and we're just hoping for continued improvement there. And, and the potential is there. We just got to perform in the race. So we're excited to see where we're going to end up. The GMAC Championship in Owensboro is right around the corner. What do you feel like this team has to be accomplishing at the Cedarville Open in two weeks to get ready for the postseason? Well, we definitely want to have a strong effort at Cedarville Open. We don't want to go a month uh, from Carnegie Mellon to at the region meet um, without getting a good effort in. And so definitely at Cedarville Open, we want to get a good effort in and really challenge ourselves to be ready for the conference meet. We know Trevecca is looking really strong, and, and we don't want to take that lightly at all. And uh, we want to just you know, show what we can do with all the hard work that we've been putting in the season. So we're definitely looking for a good effort to lead us in, good effort at Cedarville Open to lead us into the conference meet. As a senior, how bittersweet will it be running in your final collegiate race with this group of guys you've, you've gotten to know over the past four years? It's going to be very bittersweet, uh, more bitter than sweet. I'm definitely going to miss running with the guys and, and competing with them, racing with them, traveling to meets. Uh, it's just going to be it's going to be more sad, definitely, than sweet. Um, but at the same time, I, I feel like as a senior, you know, I've been preparing to be a leader for three years, and I'm ready to be our team, and I'm just thankful to be able to help the team and just do the best that I can, um, and hopefully that it, it'll, the end of the season will go really well for us. So.